shaking. So today we're going to be working with VideoPad Editor. We're going to add an overlay arrow to our video. And to get started, open VideoPad Editor. You're going to want to start a new project. Once that's loaded, go ahead and add a file. And for file, we'll go ahead and just add one of my YouTube videos. And then we're going to want to add our file that we want to overlay on top of it. For this one, I just want to add a red arrow. We're not going to put it anywhere pointing at anything in the video, just showing how to add it and you can adjust what you need for your video. So we'll go back to video files. We'll take our file, add it to the timeline. Then right here, it says drag and drop your video, text, and image clips here to overlay. That's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to take our arrow we want to add, drop it in. I'm going to go ahead and add it to the entire video. Just to show you, it will be there. All right, if we go ahead and look here, we can see the arrow is on top of our video. And which is no good. We don't want it on top of our video. So what we need to do is size it, scale it down, go to video effects, make sure you're clicked on top of it and make sure your arrow is selected. Go to video effects, motion and transforms and scale. We're gonna go ahead and scale that down to about 0.2 is about right. 0.18 is fine. And then next, we also need to position it. We don't want it right in the middle of our video. So there's two ways to get there. Either press the plus sign here and then click on position or the roundabout way. Go back to video effects, motion and transforms and position. From position, you can see it. Grab the horizontal. So you go across the screen there. And vertically, we want it to go down. So it's an addition to. You can see right there, that's about where we wanted our screen. Let's back it up a little bit, just for the heck of it. Go ahead and exit this. Go back and hit play on the video. Make sure the whole project is selected. I usually just click in a blank space here. But as you can see, we have our arrow in our video, everything worked out, and that'll stay there the entire video. If you like this tutorial and would like to see more, please like, comment, and subscribe to this video. Thanks for watching.